psilocybin, you've all heard about it, it's been talked about, and is rapidly gaining popularity. What's missing, however, is a systematic review on the use of psilocybin for chronic neuropathic pain, which we sought to uncover. What we discovered amongst the hundreds, if not thousands of studies, is that although psilocybin has been used in society for many, many years, what isn't known is the exact effect of how it modulates pain. We uncovered conditions such as cluster headache, migraines, tension headaches, fibromyalgia, many neuropathic conditions that plague people every day with chronic pain. And many of them face issues such as treatment resistance. Although we were not able to find level one data, we did find a significant amount of trials that share a few things. One of which is a dose of 0.14 mg per kg, which seems to be the accepted standard along with the lack of significant adverse events. So although we haven't discovered it all, we do know that it's safe. We do know a dose that may work, and we do know the conditions that they may work for. There's a lot of work to be done, but we hope that this spurs on the conversation for future research that uses standardized outcomes and stringent laboratory tools to properly study and discover what the potential of this molecule is. Thank you.